<clears throat> Phoebus Dew Buddies, this is Feather Farm Said. My name's Tyler. We have plenty of stuff to do today, so let's get after it. So, yesterday, Tuesday, me and Sarah spent all day at home. We didn't go to the wedding we were invited to. And uh, we checked on this pig every hour, every hour and a half. And she just didn't seem to go into labor. And we waited and we waited, no piglets. So about midnight last night, I got up out of bed, got dressed, came out, nothing. All right, I'm going to sleep. So I slept till about 4.30 got up came out and guess what two piglets wouldn't you know it i should have uh what a stinker so we have two i'm gonna go check on her now it's finally daylight i can get in there with her and see what's going on okay mama's doing good ain't jenny pig you're doing good but you still only have two babies. That's all right. You're a good mama. You're a good mama. Can I see your babies? Huh? Good mama. Look at these cute little ripper snappers. Hey! Look this. They have like red stripes, almost like a chipmunk. Is that it? Huh, Jenny? Is that it? Is that all the babies? I guess. If that's all you're going to give us, that's all you're going to give us. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. You guys are cute. Hey, hey, relax, relax. Relax, I get it, I get it, it's okay. It's okay, Jenny, I'll leave your babies alone. Two little girls, Jenny. Two little girls. Good job, mama. Good job. I mean, I wish we had more, but I'm not gonna complain over two. Careful, Mama. Riching around. I know. I'll get you a drink. You want a drink? Got, got that uh, dry mouth? Huh? Got that dry mouth? You're a good Mama. Gentle. Hey, good girl. Careful. Careful. Look at these little cuties. Jenny, you had such cute babies. Good job, Jenny. Good job, Mama. Well, it's a little disappointing she didn't have more piglets, but we're not gonna get discouraged. She's being a good mom, you know, litter numbers isn't everything, so I gotta get everybody fed, get her some water, and probably go get her some electrolytes probably give her some uh, Pedialyte or something just to help bring her system back. We want to make sure she, she stays healthy. You know, healthy moms make healthy babies. Okay. Ginger's up and eating. Let's check on these babies. Guys. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. Huh? Hey, bigger. Hey, Pigger. Huh? Don't worry, Jenny. I'll keep them warm while you're away. Are you looking for a teat? Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Huh? My little bacon seeds. Hey. 
Hey, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Hey, cutie. You have a little white face like Dad. Hey, Mr. Beefy. So I actually found a, I don't know, mummified piglet in the hay here where she was laying. So she had three, uh, you know, you kind of expect that a little bit, but not really. But two is, two is, I guess, for her first litter, we're going to let it go at that. You know, it's two healthy little piglets. So... I'm uh, happy with that. Now we just have to get, I gotta get Mavis, or yeah, Mavis, I gotta get Black Betty to pee in a cup so I can test her pee. We have a pregnancy test for Black Betty. Because Black Betty, so all day yesterday, Black Betty laid over in her hut, wouldn't get up, didn't wanna eat, wasn't hungry. Jenny was doing the same thing, so I figured, oh, we're close, you know, we're getting there. And. I mean, Black or Jenny Ginger, the one that gave me gave two piglets, definitely, definitely was close. You know, her her udders came in. She, I had milk squirt out of her. You know, it was for sure a thing. And I don't know. I still wonder. You know, is is Black Betty just having sympathy pain, sympathy labor, or whatever? With her sister, I don't know. You know, they're right beside each other in the huts, oinking at each other, and <sighs> what do I know? So, I checked out both the little girls. Mom drank a full bottle of uh, <laughs> Pedialyte, whatever it is. So, uh, they are both little girls. They both have 14 teats. And they're most perfectest little perfects ever born on the farm here so far. So we're gonna jump for joy, buddies. But she's a good mom. She lays down nice and gently and makes sure, you know, if a pig, a little piglet squeals, she jumps up quick and makes sure she doesn't sit on them or step on them or anything like that. Hey, buddy, you make cute little babies. Not sure where the chipmunky line pattern came in, but you know, you're a dad. You're a proven stud muffin, buddy. Proven stud muffin, buddy. How's that make you feel? How's that make you feel, buddy? You're a good pig. All right, I got it. I got your breakfast, buddy. Well, chores are done, so I'm going to work in the garden till about lunchtime. Got to get this stuff done. I want to get garlic planted soon so I have this one bed where I had tomatoes planted all cleaned out I got to rototill it good but uh, this one over here that bed they had blueberry bushes planted in it and I don't know I'm not sure what 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 happened but the blueberry bushes all died I got uh, fruit and berry fertilizer and I direct fertilize the fruit and berry are yeah I've direct fertilized the blueberry bushes and the strawberries and a lot of the strawberries died and all the blueberry bushes died so I'm not entirely sure if I screwed up by direct fertilizing those the blueberries and strawberries from what I gather that was my my screw up so learn from now on don't direct fertilize water fertilize you know so you live you learn we learn we learn every day Okay, there we go. Garden bed all cleaned out. Uh, they had, I don't know, cut off pieces of, of slab wood or whatever on the edges and in the middle for a walkway. So I took all that out. I'm gonna rototill this and then uh, make this one bed, well not one big bed, but I'm gonna break it down into 30 inch beds. You know, I probably get four in here or something. Oh, but, oh well, I'm gonna, I think it's about time for lunch. I gotta ch check what time it is, but I think it's time for lunch. So go in for lunch, and then I have some running to do this afternoon. So I think that'll be about the end of it for today around here. Oh, and we gotta go check the piglets. 
You know, we can't forget about them little suckers. And little June bugs in heat. Hey, girlfriend, you want to be with <laughs> Butchie in the worst way? Hey. Why are you fussy today, girlfriend? Why are you fussy? How you doing, Jinjin? You keep your babies warm? You didn't have any more. So, I guess you're doing pretty good. Keep them warm, keep them alive. Well, everybody's still doing good. So, it's kind of amazing to me how friendly these little piglets are. They don't even squeal. Like, Juno's piglets, when we had them, they were terrified of humans. And they're supposed to be a pet pig. These things, I don't care. As long as you're keeping them warm. So far, they're not squealers. Some point in the next two days, me and Sarah got to sit down and package all this soap. This Saturday, we are doing our first craft show. So we have to box, sticker, label, all that soap. We have a bunch of other stuff that needs finished packaging. So that's going to be a job for another day. But right now it's lunchtime. So. Mmm, Sarah made steak stir fry. What is it, Sarah? Tangy something sauce? Yeah. Tangy something sauce. Tangy sweet and sour. Tangy sweet and sour. See if this is good. Working in the shop this afternoon. Where is it at? Ah, there it is. Finished some things on the BCS, put a new clutch cable on it, new throttle cable. Man, that thing is smooth as silk. I, I'm gonna service it before winter, but it's rotor tailing, buddy. We're getting it done. One step at a time. We're gonna have garlic planted in this bed soon. Tell you what, it ain't easy keeping the thing going in a straight line. I thought, oh, this is simple, easy rototilling. Yeah, it's rough bouncing around trying to keep going straight down the road. It's gonna, it's gonna take some getting used to to get nice even rows and have it look good around here next spring. If I could only teach you how to mow grass, buddy. Hank, what a dork. So anyhow. It's getting close to my evening run. Sarah just came out and informed me we have a busy evening after after work. So I'm gonna go check on the piglets before I leave. And that's gonna be the end of the day. We're getting done. We're getting the rotor tiller and done. Tomorrow is gonna be busy afternoon, so we're gonna work at home in the morning and then busy running around in the afternoon. And Friday, jam-packed full, busy. Saturday crap show. We're going to a crap show. Rain or shine. Make some spritz vets. will sell this goat milk soap crap. <laughs> so, oh well. See you, lovey. Bye. See you in the wash. Keep it on the sunny side. Hey, Jenny. Jen, Jen. Look at them babies, Jenny. You did such a good job. Hey. Gorgeous little thing. Gorgeous. Hey, you're so cute. Such a cutie. Such a cutie. Hey. Okay, we'll put you back. Are you want to give me kisses? Hey, Maybelline. 
I don't know if why you just won't learn. Just won't learn. Sniffer it. You nasty. Alan, you're as nasty as your dad. Ugh. Jimmy!